Welcome back. I'm Jay. We've got Steve behind the camera. This is the Heads Up Show. And today we are building a helmet for a very special friend of the show. Big shout out. I don't know if this information has been released to the public, but we're going to break the news right here. Adventure athlete who is a Division Three quarterback at a school, Linfield College in Oregon, signed a contract. He's going to France to play football as a quarterback. This is the helmet that he's gonna be wearing over there. So we're putting all of the pieces on this. He got some pretty unique things here. We're gonna be doing some stuff that we've never done before. And I got a feeling this thing is gonna look pretty good. Um, we don't have the decals that go on the helmet. He's gonna be getting those when they get there. He's gonna be repping Green Gridiron, which we love about that. So thank you very much, Clark, or Adventure Athlete. So if you haven't checked him out or you don't know about him, go check out his channel. He's going to be doing a ton of videos about what it's like to actually be an American football player playing in another country. You're gonna to have to learn some French, so hopefully you are studying now. So here we go. So Clark is gonna be going with a Riddell Speed Flex helmet with a full blackout package. This is similar to what he wore. Doing some chin strap upgrades. He's doing Douglas Easy Pro. He's doing a whole bunch of stuff. So this is gonna be pretty cool. This show is doing well. It's fun. I mean, he's a put together guy. I, I love this show. He talks about stuff that there's not too, I mean, there's very few people that are doing what he does and talking about the things that, that he's talking about. So if you are fascinated with what's going on, what it's like to be a college football player, it's great. So what I've done here is I just took off the chin strap with the cam locks. So these are the Sports Star Speed Flex adapters. And we're actually gonna remove the snap posts here because we are going to be converting these adapters to handle the Douglas buckles, which as we know, Steve, we love the Douglas buckles. Even with the cam lock upgrade, he wants buckles. And I don't know. Okay. Have, have, have we ever done this before? Have we ever upgraded these? Like this? Um, oh, to go from an adapter to another adapter to a buckle? Yeah. Probably yeah. not. It's like an adapter on top of an adapter on top of an adapter. So these are now good. So these will pop in really easy. You see how this goes, Steve? So if you want to make your speed flex lose the ratchet or cam lock system, this is how you do it. And with the adapter and the Douglas buckles or any other buckles, I, you're still under like a $30 swap. It's pretty cool. I know he's going to be kicking himself the first time he gets an interception from a Frenchie. Hey, it's going to happen. You shake it off. All right, so those are now ready to take uh, the chin strap. Where's the chin strap? Here, let's put this guy in. He's going with a Sports Star T Rex Hurricane All Black. So, what we've got on the lower straps is we need to put the Douglas buckles. So everything about this helmet, so you got what is, you got a cardinal helmet with a Green Bay Gold face mask. So Clark has been playing on the team. See, Steve, I got it right here on my watch. Oh, it's you the, did. I'm gonna I'm gonna butcher this completely. For my three years of French in high school, it tells me it's the Pionnier de Touraine. You got that? Sure. Pioneers of Touraine. Oh, that's right. how us Americans would say it. I know I'm gonna get it corrected. There's no doubt in my mind. That's it. It's done. Sweet. That's it. That is amazing. It's such a good product. Good for them. Yeah, I love it. Yep. You know, I'm gonna take this off. See, this is kind of getting on my getting on my nerves. Sorry, Clark. We'll, we'll send you all your warning labels. <laughs> yeah. So what we've got here is we got Boss Tech flag, French flag, because, well, it seems a little bit appropriate. Mm -hmm. We're going to be going, going to be going high on these. This is per his request. 
He's going to be repping the green gridiron name on his helmets. It'll certainly be a conversation starter over there. People will be like, what is green gridiron, Jay? Yeah, first off, they don't even know what the words are. <laughs> so they're going to have to start with that, and then it's going to have to be translated. Well, I wonder how many other people will be on that team that aren't from France either. Probably a lot. Uh, no, I think that in the European teams, they only get two that can be from the U.S. What? Oh, I didn't yeah. know that. Yeah. Oh, wow. Clark, let us know, or anybody out there who plays in Europe or outside the U.S., uh, how many American football players are allowed on the team? Good question. So we got here, Steve, the Black Shadow. We have an Oakley Prism. This is our last one. We got more coming. So if you want to get your hands on an Oakley Prism visor, put the link below. And if we're sold out, sign up, put your email address in there, put your phone, your cell phone number in there. You'll get a text message. The second we add it back into inventory, you'll get alerted so you can go ahead and buy one. We do have more on the way. We basically bought every single visor that Oakley has in their warehouse that they said that they could send to us. So once those are gone, it could be months before we get more. So make sure that you jump on those because they are uh, a, a tough ticket right now. And I don't know when we're going to get more. So I know you're going to want to ask me, but I'm going to tell you. Yeah, the link will be in the description. It's a little harder when there's a visor on because you can't get your hand in there the way that you would want it. If you want to see a how-to video on how to install the new Prism Visor, go check out I Know Football. He just put out a video a couple days ago. He goes super detailed on how to put that visor. I mean, dude, what a great look, man. So let's go over all these pieces that Clark got when he upgraded his helmet. We've got a Cardinal Riddell Speed Flex with a blackout package. We have the Zudi EG Crusader face mask with an Oakley Prism visor. We've got black unbranded Under Armour clips. We don't have any in stock right now. This is a pair that we just had sitting around. Lucky for Clark. Uh, we have a Sportstar T-Rex Hurricane chin strap. We've converted that with the Sportstar adapters on the side with a Douglas Easy Pro buckle. On the back, we've got a USA Boss Tech flag decal, a Chrome France flag, and then we've got green gridiron 3D bumper on the back and a green gridiron 3D bumper on the front. Did I miss anything, Steve? No, man, you did a good job. Keep an eye out for a new product that he's rolling Yeah, out. new product announcement. He has the gridiron glove. We posted something on our Instagram not too long ago. Go check it out. Watch some of his videos. He's got it on Kickstarter. He's raising money to see if it's good to go into production. In a nutshell, this was a school project where he created this thing with a couple of other people, other uh, classmates of his. And now it's potentially going to become real. So he's got to raise a little bit of money to get the whole thing started. And if he does, it will become real. And I think it's pretty cool. I can't wait to get my hands on one of these things. At first, it's like, oh, that's kind of hokey. But then when you kind of think about it and you watch the videos, it's like, yeah, that makes sense. It does. Uh, and I wouldn't be surprised if we start seeing these things pop up like on the sidelines during games. Besides all that, can't wait to see him in France. Like, subscribe, leave comments below, click the notification bell if you want to see more videos like this. Check out his channel, check out I Know Football's channel. And until next time, au revoir. Ah, uh, cheers.